Good afternoon, tr traders. It is October 31st, Friday, and the U.S. stock market is closed. Hey, the Dow Jones Industrial Average has made over 400 points in the last two days, and it made, of course, all-time highs today. I could been saying I want to see this thing go through the death zone like a hot knife through butter and I think that is exactly what has happened. Uh, Dow of course gained 195 points a day and I got to say that it uh, is probably we probably we haven't we I, I don't want to say we've seen the last of the death zone but the death zone is probably going to become more like a floor now than a ceiling so uh, I'm I'm happy I still am nervous about this market I, I it still looks <laughs> awful overbought to me but it's definitely through uh, that uh, area that was giving us a lot of trouble. Uh, we had a pretty good day. Uh, we actually we closed out five positions a day. All were profitable, and we closed out to, close to seven thousand dollars on those five positions. We are carrying twenty three positions going into over the weekend and going into Monday and. You know, we, we have positive uh, over $3,000 on that, but I'm going to tell you, positive $3,000 is not a lot with 23 positions on. That could disappear in the flick of a hand. Um, I'm not sure what to say about it. We, or, uh, 12 of the positions are positive, 11 are negative, so it's pretty much split down the middle. Uh, no outliers on either side. Uh, I, again, I still have this feeling that nothing really wants to cut loose in our portfolio despite all this uh, enthusiasm apparently in the overall market. but. Uh, you know, gotta admit, this is very much a, a bull market again, and 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 there's a lot of buyers in here. I, uh, I you know, I just gotta hope for the best. But I, I still have this feeling, you know, after having, you know, seen 400 point gain plus in the Dow, and today, you know, we basically made maybe ten thousand dollars I would like to see more than that I after these kinds of gains but it didn't happen we'll just have to wait and see um, we play the system and I, you know why should I complain when I make money anyway let's take a look at the chart okay this is the record holding Dow Jones industrial average and you can see here how this thing came out of this um, downside, a little bit of downside action that we had on Wednesday and then yesterday and today. Just explosion and you can see this the market did close very close to its highs today. Uh, no pullback at all today to speak of so it's obviously very very strong these lines represent what I call the death zone. They have been a real problem for us for um, several weeks and we definitely got through it today, uh, well yesterday and today and as I say I, I'm looking for this area now to be uh, more an area of resistance as uh, when the market does correct but we'll just have to see, see what happens. I'll show you a couple of trades. We, you know, we had no outliers today. What, what I mean is, you know, we had one, two, one thousand, two thousand, and a couple three thousand dollar trades, but nothing that really cut loose. Um, but overall, it's pretty strong. I, I, you know, the um, solar energies were pretty strong today so I'll show you a couple of those this first one is uh, Canadian solar and we haven't had too much uh, 
going in Canadian solar recently, although, you know, historically it's been a great market for us. We got into this right after the open. You can see this thing just kept going up. No pullbacks here, and I like to see that. You know, there's no scares here. This thing was really uh, headed up, and we're holding uh, about $2,000 in Canadian solar. And then uh, the other real strong solar uh, market for us today was Solar City, and this was uh, this one we actually gotten into yesterday, and then we had this monster scap up. So th this is keeping us in going into a third day, and, and you know, look at this. There's just no pullback in in, in this uh, stock at all, and oftentimes people who you know they got to buy pullbacks, you know, just get stuck with this kind of situation because this thing isn't pulling back at all to give anybody uh, um, an entry point. Fortunately we got our entry point yesterday almost on the close. Bought it very high and I'm glad we did. We're holding over three thousand dollars in Solar City. So good day, record highs, I'm a little bit nervous about all those positions, but I'm still going to have a good weekend, and I hope you guys have a good weekend, too. We'll see you on Monday.